<laughs> there he is. Been waiting for you, tough guy. I'm here with Men's Vice Journal. Great. What now? Feast your eyes, bros and bastards. You're taking an exclusive look at the most legendary Yakuza to ever walk the streets. Thanks to the Tatara channel, he's the talk of the town once more. Introducing Kazuma Kiryu. Ah, uh, I see what's going on here. They're hyenas lapping up a bigger man's fame. How about you give us an interview, Kiryu-san? Your story's like <laughs> incredible. A top dog faking his own death all so he could live in secrecy. How do you feel now that that's out in the open? Any comments, concerns? Give me something. Out of the way. <laughs> oh, ow. I think I broke a bone. <laughs> no way he got hurt just from that. Talk about bad acting. Yo, did you guys see that? You freaking wrecked me! That right there's the real, uninhibited Kazuma Kiryu. No! I'm not in the mood for child's play, so get the hell out of my sight. This is the same Kiryu who's sick, right? Oh, what the fuck, man? That shit really did break a bone! Well, guess what? It's all on camera. Huh. I'm surprised you didn't die on impact. Hurry up and get him, guys! I'll be right here recording. I even got a killer title. Legendary Yakuza Kazuma Kiryu gets straight up owned on camera. You really want another reality check, huh? Looks like your boys are too scared to move a muscle. That's all right. We got ourselves an arrangement. <gasps> Looks like Ebina knew we were coming. First he spreads lies, then he lays a trap. I'd say his true colors are starting to show. Right. This pretty much amounts to a declaration of war. Then how should we handle this, Kiryu-san? No question. If they want to fight, they've got one. Let's go! No begging for mercy now. Yeah, give him hell. Bring it on. Double the trouble. Double the flame. Now we're talking. Watch this. Before. You said you had an arrangement with the Seiryu clan. What did you mean by that? <sighs> Hard to say. Answer me now, or that bone's going back in its socket. And I can't guarantee you'll like it. <sighs> okay! Uh, uh, I got a message from the Tatara channel. They knew about you, said you'd be coming to Seiryu HQ. They also said to taunt you and get footage that the clan would protect us if we did. So Sunhee's guess was right. Ebina really has been pulling Tatara's strings. Yeah. And so is Shira's his accomplice. They also made Kasuga go to Hawaii. There had to be a reason for that, too. What kind of reason, though? Let me ask what's happening in Hawaii. I've got a contact over there. Who would that be? He probably means Hanawa-san. 
guy from the Taidoji faction. He's not picking up? Isn't it late at night over there? It could be they're all snoring by now. 